Hey, what's good? It's Cadillac like Tracks. This is going to be Quick Tip 140. And today's Quick Tip is about a feature that I just found out about yesterday. It's about how to do a note repeat or a hi hat roll or snare roll or any type of roll inside of machine, excuse me, inside of Fruity Loops. So, this is a new technique that I just found out about yesterday. And um, you may or may not be aware of this. I'm going to use this sound right here, which is the snare. It's just the default snare. But if you go right here into the. Um, miscellaneous functions right here you can use the arpeggiator or the what is the arpeggio arp whatever and uh what you can do is you can go right here to chord and instead of making it play a chord you just go to none that way it'll just play one key instead of playing a chord or going up and down and all that so it'll play one key and once you turn the settings on making it go up or down or up and down or whatever direction you make it go it'll start to play just that one key so you can hear it right here so it's an easy way to do snare rolls or a hi-hat roll or any type of roll on any type of sample. And um, also right here we have the time knob where you can adjust this time knob and it will adjust how fast it goes. You can get real fast even if I go all the way down. It gets uh, real, real fast. Way faster than I, I think you could do with like a 128 you know, snap or whatever. So way faster than you could roll with anything else I probably. And um, also another thing that y'all should know about if you've been using Fruit Loops is that a lot of these knobs, some of these knobs, if you right click them, like for example, this time one, you have this thing right here where it says set and it has, you know, custom, you know, settings. So that's half a step right there. Or I can go, you know, fourth a step. So you can use these custom settings. It's not on all the knobs, but it's on some of them. Another one it's on is like the slide knob and just different knobs where a setting like that would actually be good instead of just doing it freely. But uh, that's it, man. Cadillac Tracks. Just a quick tip. If you didn't know about that, I'm glad to share it with y'all. I just found out about that, and that's crazy. But uh, I bet a lot of people use that to do quick rolls real quick and easy. So if you're new to my channel, make sure you check out my other quick tips. I'm sure I got something in there that you're not aware of or that you need to inform yourself on. So make sure you check out my other quick tips. You can even search my videos if you're looking for a certain topic since I have so many. And also, make sure you check out my custom MK3 template. If you're using Machine and Fruity Loops and you're on my channel because you're trying to learn how to use them together, you're probably overlooking my template. The template is something I built to control Fruity Loops with the machine. And um, I kind of stress on it on all my videos, so make sure you at least have an understanding of, of what it is and how it works. And maybe you could take the time and the patience to make yourself one and just set yourself up something to utilize the machine and Fruity Loops together besides the, all the ways they go together already. All right, man, until next time, one.